Communication. Every day we communicate with each other to share information and socialise. It's how we connect with other people and let them know what we're thinking and feeling. Communication is at the heart of good, active support. We need to communicate well when providing choice of activities, prompting to perform a step, or instructing how to do it. It helps the person you support to make choices and receive assistance to engage in activities. When communicating with people you support, it helps to speak clearly and not too fast. Use short sentences and words familiar to the person. Provide one message at a time. Allow the person time to understand what was communicated. If the person hasn't understood, restate the message using shorter sentences and focusing on key words. Some people have difficulty understanding verbal communication. Combining speech with other forms of communication makes the message clearer. Just pop those Using objects, gestures or facial expressions with speech helps the person to see what you mean. We all use a variety of communication methods. The people you support may use words, gestures, facial expression, body language or keyword signs. They may use alternative and augmentative communication aids, such as picture books or apps. Job. Well done. Paying attention to the person is key to understanding their communication. What is the message they're telling you? What's this one? It's important to be patient and to give the person time to communicate. If in doubt, check you've understood their message. Communicating well is necessary for good active support. It helps the person you support to make choices and receive assistance to engage in activities.